Hello everyone, welcome back to Altrius Plays Quake 2. This is the, not the Reckoning, this is Ground Zero, the second mission pack released shortly after the Reckoning. So we're still in 1998, we're still retro gaming, and I said that I would finish the game pointing at this, and here I am finishing the game, well, the episode's pointing at this. will start again, I'm going to pick up the Mega Health, I'm going to go in here, which is something we haven't seen before. Brilliant. Um, there's, there's noises. don't like the fact that that's trying to tip me into the lava, it's a little bit disconcerting. Uh, but... I'm just going to walk through and see what happens. This feels like an opening later sort of situation. Lift activated. Might have to use this. I feel like there's going to be something. Can we go up? Grand. Okay. What is happening? What is this? Leave the security back. I've got another props launcher. And I'm going to turn my headphones down because it's breaking my brain. This is interesting. I like this. Part of me feels like we should be able to explode this, you know? Because it's using the same sort of effects as the gears that we broke in the first level. It's not worth it. Let's, let's do something else. Oh, dude. Uh, we do have a fair few of these shotgun shells to our name, so we'll probably get away with using the shotgun for a while. There's a lot of new, new material right now. What part of the level? Okay, this is the part of the level that I thought that was going to take us up to. So. Just keep exploring. Uh, I don't need to actually waste my ammo, though. <laughs> That's not strictly necessary. If I take this, I'm not... Com oh. Take this. now. I, I did get it. I got it on my way It's fine. Appreciate the armor. 49 is a weird number. Again, I have to assume that maybe Nightmare Mode has um, altered the level... The, the amount of armor you get for each fight. Because it seems like a really awkward and weird amount of armor. Right, let's continue with where we left off last time. Uh, you've seen me fight with this before, so I'm not actually going to make you watch it again. So bear with me, and we'll be there soon. I feel like this should be moving. Why is this not moving? Did I activate this? Maybe there's multiple. It would be cool, I was just musing, if the uh, if you did in one level works through to the next level. It may even be the case, because... In this level, there are those things moving around um, somewhere in here. That, well, they're already moving. It may have been stuff that I activated in the previous level. These ones. Okay. Anyway, uh, don't be a stranger. I'll see you in a minute. But it broke eventually, but I don't know if that was because they shot it or because it ran out. It's interesting. Actually. There may be a new bit here. I don't think we've seen this before. Oh, that's the other side of it. Remember I said don't push it? Because there's something. This was the something. So I think that if I push the button on the other side of that. Which, by the way, definitely has an enemy. Right there. Oops. There. It's obviously going to smash into that. It's, <laughs> it's not even up for debate. Uh, so let's fight our way through this cavern again. So up here. This just fell. Is it supposed to... <laughs> Is this a soft lock? Can I get back? No, it's not. Okay, I'm not even locked out. I was upset, but I can get back through. It's just a troll, basically. Now I can push this. We knew what was behind beyond it, you see. Okay, it's literally just a way back through to there. Gotcha. Uh, okay, we can continue to explore. This falling down does not get me out of there. Can't remember what it was we were going to do when we got here. It was probably... Oh yeah, it was not die to them things. I don't know. So yeah, I was using the Tesla here. 
And um oh, 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 oh. That's rude. It forces you to be here. Alright, back in a minute. Um <laughs> but I don't know what happened there. I got close to it, and it feels like maybe the idea was that that guy there was supposed to have pushed it. Because now I can get through here. I'm so confused. Yeah, it's been pushed. Uh, I'm triggering scripted events. That, like, the world has never seen. These are amazing. So whichever way you go into this, it explodes. And you have to go the other way. Right, so I accidentally <laughs> failed to trigger this. Nearly softlock myself, were it not for the fact that um, you can crawl under the other one. That's so weird. So you can only have, I believe, you can only have five Tesla. But I think these things will attack the Tesla. Oh, there's a... Oh, they did. There's a knife here. <laughs> I just have to kill it. Can I avoid it? Probably go underneath it. I don't want to know what's around the corner, though, do I? Right, I guess we can maybe grenade it. Oh, hello. Make sure you hit it before it's not going to work. Found the secret. What? <laughs> I'm getting very lucky with random grenades finding secrets. Although, to be fair, in the last mission pack, when I did that... Oh, that was uh, risky. In the last mission pack, when I did that, it was uh, a secret I was supposed to find. Which is a very strange concept. I'm going to save that because it took me ages. <laughs> what secret did I find? Was it that? Oh good, the silencer. Just what the doctor ordered. Again, not use the silencer. Don't know what they're for. Now I don't know what the IR goggles are for. Uh, that said... Um, whilst watching the video back, I did notice that the IR goggles showed you everything that you could collect in bread and shoot. So I'm wondering if what they can do is show you like secrets you can explode into, for example. I'll just take that, maybe. Use the security pass to access the tectonic stabilizer. Again, how many of these are going to break? You really need to use better doors in the, like it's a mine, right? We, we know it's a mine. You should have really gone through the material science guys. You needed some um what's the word I'm thinking of? You need contracts, you needed uh, consultants to tell you. <laughs> kind of annoying there's nothing on this. Well, I guess considering only one of them will fall. Anyway. <laughs> You needed a consultant to say this is not the right type of door for this situation. <laughs> what happens if you get tremors, right? Strobe tremor, tremors. Strobe tremor. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? I said to come back to this, so let's. Let's just throw up a quad. <laughs> this is a secret, and there's a door in it. This door locked. This door locked. How I opened this. <laughs> How I fixed it. Fixed door. Great. Hmm. Too fast. Remember that. There's got to be something that opens it. I have no idea what it might be. Oh, <laughs> son of a... Okay. This bloke moves too fast. Us old people, you know. It's... 
we're beyond it. Uh, I think I was in the right place just then. Oh, I know where we go. Yeah. It's not here. Okay. Cool setup, by the way. I appreciate the thought in the level design. Again, complexity of level design that is not so overly complex as to be confusing and confounding. Um, but, you know, you, we are... What can I hear about it? And we're talking about this idea where... Um, you can go into that big chamber from two different directions and whichever one you go into will be locked off. But the other one, as long as you don't break the trigger <laughs> that makes the enemy do the thing, that will continue to work. What are you finding our companions sitting around headlessly? Um, with. I don't know where they came from. They should all have a thing. That's a bizarre, bizarre lift. Is it the door or is it the floor? <laughs> Computer updated. How are we doing on secrets? So three secrets. Four more kills to get. That's uh, four. Ten more kills to get. Ten? Yeah. <laughs> Suddenly couldn't remember what I even read. And we need to find the secret that is going to unlock the door in the other secret. And I'm really worried that that's going to be very hard to find, and I don't know where it's going to be. So, uh, should we have a quick shifty? Should we go up here? No. That scared me. <laughs> I was very surprised by that. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah, it's happened. Got some grenades, grenades. It's kind of weird that you can't get in here. From there. We'll uh, take the slow lift home. I'm a smidgen worried about the amount of ammo I've got for anything because, you know, we've got... Is that how many shotguns I've got? And, oh, shells, yeah, 146. Why well, have I got two shotguns? Um, you know, we, we've got most ammo, or is most DPS and explosions at the moment? <laughs> it seems. So you made the mistake of stopping firing. Thank you. Lift inactive. Oh, what now? You again, but worse. Great. I feel like using Teslas is going to be the way forward in this game. This one inactive? This one active. I knew you were going to be there, so don't even try it. Boring. You're on the ceiling now? I'm trying to figure out how these work. I think they just keep, do damage until they get attacked enough to not do damage anymore. I don't think you're allowed on the ceiling. I just want to mention that. They kind of explode each other, huh? 
Oh, don't pick that up. Oh. I thought because I couldn't pick it up, I was safe, but I could actually pick it up. I was just doing it wrong. Ah! Hey, look. <laughs> this is going to be orcs. First of all, you're just going to have to attack each other. If I put two next to each other, I'm a genius. Because they can only attack one at a time. Okay. Not that much of a genius. My phone just lit up. Do I need to know about it? Oh. Ah. This is really hard. <laughs> well, I warned it's four arms, though. You got four arms. Lachettes! Uh, that's pretty good. Volumetric fog. Wow. No! <laughs> what are you supposed to do? <laughs> I'll see you in a minute. So we're going to go this way. Because I haven't yet. <laughs> I just want something different to do. There's a rocket launcher this way. That's going to make a big difference, actually. Which had bullets. <laughs> Give me bullets. Much more tactical game now, huh? Save it again. Blimey. Everything I do, save it anew. It's my new, new mantra. Golly me. You know what? Grab it. Is it, is it coming this way? Is there a way through? Yeah. Hello. Ah. This... I'm really struggling. <laughs> if you know this. Oops. Bring everything into my Teslas. These things are OP. They kind of are. <laughs> Not actually kidding. Oh, they die for a while. Yeah, okay, we learned that. They don't last forever. But they do have a, a good range. They spend a while. Oh, I did get a message. Hold on. Continuing. Don't like these guys in this situation. Right. Alright. You know what? I told you, all my good DPS is in explosions. I uh, can't help but notice this uh, <laughs> so there's a, you want to call it a redeemer? What's this thing called? An ETF rifle. This is even newer of a thing. Oh, this is a bit what the flechettes are for. It's just too much, too much baddie. It's a nail gun. 
We even had a discussion about fishettes on the old uh, on the old stream when Pete was here. Can't remember why we brought up the fishettes, but there weren't any in the original series. The series? This one, you know. I keep getting, I'm, I keep turning the corner and finding something else to attack, so I'm gonna save it fairly regularly. <laughs> At this point, I know that. Yeah, pick it up. Remember, um, remember, uh, Wolfenstein. Really, the original, and how it would, um, you couldn't pick something up unless you were facing it. You didn't recognize the things on the ground unless they were in front of you. Interesting uh, situation. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not changing. I'm gonna go as far as I can in this level without pressing any buttons. <laughs> yeah, okay. That seemed like a thing I could try. Um, I'm gonna try not to alter anything. I'm gonna go only in the places that are open to me and clear it out. Because what's going to happen, knowing me, is as soon as I go around a corner, like this for example, um, I'm going to end up with all the enemies on the other side of the world coming at you like Cleopatra. Know what I mean? There you go. I've got so many of those. Is this eight? What is my... I don't even know what number my new weapon is on. It's number four. Right, I have no idea how much I've done. I don't know, much, I don't know how much I've interrupted, been interrupted. <laughs> I don't know how much I've cut out. All I know is how long the video is at the moment, and it's just 30 minutes. I'm just going to go a little bit longer. Hey, look. This is the way to do it. You twitch. Look, you just. What the smeg? It's like a vampire. Right. <laughs> okay. We've cleared out this bit. I'm saving it. This is a bit we struggled on by falling in the lava. There's a pipe which seems suspicious. And then we came out here, and then there's the pump controls, which I think we know how to operate, because we have to go up the lift. We go up here. This is cleared out. There's the other lava bit. We want to get up there, because there was a baddie up there, but we don't know how to deal with it. Um... Hmm. And this look right. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. These lifts have got a really weird logic to them, and I don't like it. They're not as fast as people. The pump room. I saved it recently, didn't I? Scary noises. <laughs> Worth a try. So this will do that. I appreciate them not sticking me with a tongue. I, got it. I can't, yeah. Console inactive. Coolant tank flooded. Isn't it supposed to be? It's coolant. Sealed. 
stay dead. <laughs> I've now learned that there are enemies that do not stay dead. And I'm hearing a slightly different sound. Um, that, oh. There's a uh, slightly deeper scrape scrape noise. Like the things that the old trespasser and jump at you. But I'm guessing maybe it's an alternative version of it? Quite a noise, isn't it? But you get a lot of shots for it. I appreciate having an alternative to the machine gun is basically the machine gun. Uh, and it's also the nail gun. It's just straight up a nail gun. Because when you run out of shots for a machine gun and you need something... It's basically what I've been asking for, actually, isn't it? It's more accurate than a machine gun. It's faster rate of fire than the rail gun. Bit intrigued by that. Um, obviously, it's going to have. I don't know what the DPS is. But... Stop that. Is this the one that was deactivated earlier? I think so. I'm not going to bother going down. It's just a way home. Right. I think I've probably recorded long enough to have a half an hour of episode after I delete everything that I don't want you to see. <laughs> so. Thank you for watching. Hope that you're enjoying this second mission pack for Quake 2. When we finish this one, we'll be coming up to the brand new mission pack that was released this year. Uh, I don't know whether I'm going to call that retrobating or not, but we'll see. And um, yeah, remember to subscribe to the channel to hear more about these videos. I'm basically focusing entirely on Quake 2 at the moment, so you're not going to miss much else. Um, I, I want to do some more... Uh, Vault Hunters Minecraft at some point, but I do not know when that point will be. So don't hold your breath. Uh, it just takes a lot longer to do those videos. And, um... Yeah, I guess I'll see you in the next episode. Join my uh, Discord, following up Master, and all that good stuff. Links down below. And I'll see you tomorrow, unless it's Friday, in which case Monday. Good day!